I like to think of the Alpha Theta Center as a very unique neurofeedback center. We map the brain first using QEEG, quantitative electroencephalogram, and we do a 10 minutes eyes open, eyes closed recording. And we use that information to develop clinical protocols for training clients' brains. My name is Michael Villanueva. I have a PhD in clinical psychology, and I am the founder and clinical director of the Alpha Theta Center. Neurofeedback is often referred to as brain training. And by brain training, we mean we are training certain frequencies up or we're training certain frequencies down. But essentially, on a superficial level, neurofeedback is feeding the information that is present within the brain, within brain waves, power levels, back to the person via electrodes that are then wired into a computer computer processes the data and will show an image or a video or a plane flying and the lightness, darkness, movement, sound levels will all be key ostensibly to certain power levels. Whatever neurofeedback does, it seems to engender or, or help the brain towards a more efficient functioning. Neurofeedback alone or with electrical or magnetic stimulation really can address a host of symptoms for anxiety, depression, even children that have autistic tendencies, learning disabilities. But it is not a blanket cure-all. Once the brain functions more efficiently, a host of symptoms tend to disappear. What we end up doing with neurofeedback is we end up targeting symptoms. We will look at the raw waveform and somebody, let's say, who has severe insomnia, we will see a predominance of certain frequencies in the brain. Then what we might do will be to train that five or six hertz down. So if they're watching a movie and they start zoning out and start getting very drowsy and sleepy, then the movie goes black. And this is where the magic happens because at its core, the brain is a novelty detection machine. And if you have a brain that is in what we call a bacon sizzle, kind of a sss, then you have an infinite degrees of choices. If you have a brain that's kind of bound up in anxiety or insomnia, then there's not so many choices. We have a new program that we've developed called the OASIS Concierge Program. And it is an intensive regimen of neural feedback along with other alternative activities, whether it is sailing, kayaking, um, scuba diving, we look to put people outside their comfort zone based on interviews with them and what they seek to have in their life. We're looking to ingratiate ourselves into the brain system on a comfortable level and an uncomfortable level to engender what we call neuroplasticity. And so this type of program involves multiple visits here along with concierge level services. So we offer, we don't offer, we insist, on doing a quantitative electroencephalogram because it will give us at a very gross level. It's, it's not like a MRI, it's not like a PET scan, but it does give us superior temporal resolution. It'll give us a good idea, excellent idea, of how the brain is communicating. With the quantitative electroencephalogram, we have a path forward because of the analysis we did. And I believe that level of analysis separates us from a lot of other neural feedback centers out there. Hi, my name is Matt Harrison. I was a patient here at Alpha Theta Center uh, about a year ago. Uh, I was a patient for about uh, three months. I think I did 30 sessions in that time and it completely changed my life. For anyone that's curious about neurofeedback, I would say that you don't want to do neurofeedback at, at the wrong place. Um, I don't think all the neurofeedback is, is equal. You definitely want to have a practitioner that really knows what they're doing. And Dr. V has been in this industry for a few decades and he knows what he's doing and he knows how to do it. The benefits that a person would receive are so profound that I think it's one of the best investments that anyone could make. So anyone that wants those benefits and wants to, to change their lives forever with something that doesn't take a lot of time, then I would absolutely say that um, Alpha Theta Center and, and Neurofeedback uh, is right for them.